Yeah, peeps. Today is another day. Now, earlier I was watching some videos online and this topic is kind of different from my usual topic. This is something that I talk about every day with my brethren them still, but it kind of feel like I need to mention it now on this platform. The question is, does it make sense for men to enter into relationships anymore? I need to hear your comments on this one. But anyway, before I get into it, remember, send this video up to 1000 likes and comments. I'm going to play a video and then when I come back, we talk about it. So forward. Women don't want to be wrong. They'd rather lie than be wrong. It's their nature. It's not a bad thing. Women run from submittance in relationships. Let me let me say this. Men commit in relationships. A woman cannot commit in a relationship. I don't care. Oh, she won't commit. She broke her commitment. She broke her commitment. She never was committed, bro. They don't. They can't. When a man commits to a relationship or a marriage with a woman, he does that in thoughts that it is forever. When a woman submits, she does that in thoughts that this is fucking awesome. And he's awesome. And I love this. And I'm getting what I want. As soon as that stops, she's like, I'm not happy. And she fucking leaves. She will, she will tear your whole family and legacy apart, bro. And we know this is a fact. So you see exactly what I'm talking about. And the funny thing is, as I said to you earlier, this is something that I've been saying for years. Does it even make sense? When you meet this woman and you know, she looks good. She have a nice personality. And you say, all right, cool. Let's see if this can work out. You as a man, you just looking at it like a woman, she look good. You like talking to her, the energy at that time is good. So you say, oh, Yo, you want to find out more. For men, most of the time, that's the case. On the other hand, as it relates to women, women not only want to see that you have a nice personality and you're clean and you dress all right, but they want to know what kind of work you do. If you drive a nice car, where you live, they want to know all these things. And I believe the messed up thing about that is if you go into a situation thinking about that, yes, I know you want to be with somebody who, you know, ambitious and somebody who's making money. But if you look at it from that point of view, then the basis of the whole relationship is going to be on what that person can do for you. And that's why I honestly believe that men are more serious about relationship and love than women. Everything that has to do with money and anything like that is a business. Now, I'm not saying that you don't have women out there that aren't like that. But the majority of women look for stuff like that and nothing is wrong you know because everybody uh, want to know say they are getting a one good stable financial relationship also but some of the times many women don't want to invest the time and the energy into something and they prefer to come and see it all ready done when the relationship starts on this basis, what happens is that a lot of the times, if the man fall on them face financially for a period of time, most of these women ready to jump out, don't want to be in the situation. Even if the man was taking care of them for like 10 years or more, it's like none of that count. Because they don't want to go through any rough times. They just think that everything is perfect. So a lot of men kill out themselves all the time to keep up with this. Then you have the aspect of children. When you go through the rough time now and things hard, a lot of these women can't hold the reins for you until you get back on your feet. 
so they think the best thing to do is jump out before it get too bad and that's messed up for the kids because now the kids live in a broken home most of the time the women have the kids and the father is like the outside parent who have to look in to add insult to injury then because the father going through a lot of bad times now then you're going to hear the father is not a good father he's a deadbeat no matter if he was doing it all along without the woman's support him turn deadbeat him not seeing him child and then quick for move on with somebody else to try to fill that space and a lot of times it don't work but they don't care them not really sit down and think about stuff like that because men are more naturally going to think about family so that's why you hear a woman will always say oh he said he want to come back to get his family but it's not his family it's me because a lot of women believe that it's all about them and though they are a part of the equation a lot of the times men just want to keep them family together and will sacrifice an amount of happiness just to see them kids them happy just to be around them kids to see all these things that happening around them women on a whole and you can tell me if i'm wrong or right i know most women going to tell me that i'm wrong we start telling themselves it wouldn't be the first time a kid grew up without a father or they'll get over it and whatever they don't really sit down and think about it carefully once their mind tell them they need to go they don't care really they hope that it don't hurt the kid but in them head them feel like no man maybe if i give the kids everything that they need then they'll be all right but there will always be a void that no one can fill but the father and a lot of women don't realize this until it's too late if the father died then we understand but if the father is alive and the kid love the father the father shouldn't even have to ask to be around them kid you see me some of them women i would prefer to make the man with them they would be around the kid all the time and when the father say yo I want to stay with the kid, make them kids stay with me. It's a problem. Now look into that. Look into that. The man that you lie down with to get this child have to beg you sometimes in some cases for spend time with them child. And then the one that you are with now have all the privileges of seeing that child and the person who at one time you were okay with lying down and creating a child with can't see the child when i look into stuff like that i wonder does it even make sense anymore because when you're with somebody there are a lot of things you sacrifice as a man just to have a family setting a certain way everything a man sacrifice and a lot of women will say I'm independent and them don't need a man and when them get in the situation them realize that it's not as easy as them think not as easy as them think so that's why I had to talk about this because I think men need to get the respect where them deserve especially a father that has kids and the picnic them love him those fathers have to be honored even if things not going right at the moment he's still the father and it's sad because women as i said in the beginning equate good with money and being a father is not all about the money it's a part of it but not all about it i believe when it comes like the father and the mother play them role and it's not overstepped then I see like relationships 
last thing because nowadays women just feel say yeah the child come out of them so they have full control not knowing that or not remembering that if the man never link up with you you're not gonna have no child it takes two so stop acting like you're Mary the things that only happen in the Bible but in reality men are just as important in the whole family scheme of things look at the stats it show single mother with a child versus a single father with a child and how the child grow up and the type of child you get look into it as me say are relationships worth it for men anymore when things are good yeah he's the best when things not so good like you want it he's the worst ever he's the villain him and the devil him do all these things and you didn't contribute anything at all he's just a bad guy what sense it make what sense does it really make but anyway that's it for me today I just wanted to share that let me hear what you have to say about the whole situation bless up